Now we are having an exciting day here at the Oasis because we're about to release a wild rock python back into the wild. And this rock python has been caught at a farm where she ate two geezers. A friend of ours went to fetch the snake, brought her to the Oasis where we patched her up, made sure that she's healthy, and now we're gonna release her back into the wild. So even if she bites you, you're gonna bleed a little bit, but she can't kill you. But it's gonna hurt. Mission halfway completed. Let's go to the back. Is she still in there? Yeah. Okay, cool. You are free. Okay, this. Oppa. No, it's okay. You can leave, bro. We have a lot of different dams in this area and rock pythons, they love to be close to water. She's gonna have a great life and we are super happy for her. One more animal which get a second chance and can now live a beautiful and peaceful life here on the Hakuna Park Oasis. Bomba! All right, so Pumba, apparently, um, we forgot to close the gate and now he just <laughs> went to the other side. So my plan is, I don't know if it will work, well, I'll try to get some figs from this tree and then just somehow tease him with them until he follows me back. Hey, leave that. Come, Pumba. Come here. No, where are you going, bro? Look, I got some figs. Pumba, I got something for you. Look here. There we go. Mm. You'll love it. I promise you. I don't want you to get hurt. He, he, there's leopards and hyenas and stuff like that out here. Let's go. Let's go, bro. Okay, let's go the other way around. Pumba, come. Yeah, let's go together. He kinda doesn't give a shit. So, I'm about to prepare the breakfast now for the monkeys. And this means we have to cut up all the fruits. And you guys are gonna help me with that. Watermelon. Oh, Pumba is gonna like these ones as well. Banana. Grapes. Honey melon. Pumba, got some melon for you. Apple. Blueberries. Some papaya. And last but not least, I also wanna add some nuts. Done. I think this is a nice angle, right? Cubes. Where you going, bro? Where yeah. you going? That looks good, right? No, 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 leave that camera, please. Thank you. Is this Mr. Kumar coming for the nuts? I was looking at the melon the whole time already. Hey! hey. hey. Guess who just came back all by himself? Didn't have to tease him with nothing. Who's here? Who's my boy? So I'm about to clean now the lion camps, chuck all the leftovers of the wildebeest in the back of the Polaris, drive it out and then we're gonna take Dexter over to the baby camp to be able to introduce him through the fence to the rest of the lions. Check this out. They really ate everything. Like, there's nothing going to waste. They even cleaned some part of the bones. Amazing. Good job, guys. Yo, good job. Good job. What's up here? What's up? All right, step number two is we have to bring the lines into the upper camp so that we can bring Dexter over here so that he can meet them through the fence. Come Dexter, come. Who's there? You can smell them, I know. What can you smell there, bro? Is that the wildebeest or is that the two new ladies? All right, so this is Khaleesi. How can I see that this is Khaleesi? The easiest way to see it is that little scar on the nose. Can you guys see that scar which has a, the shape of a little flame? 
This is the mother of the dragons, immune against fire, our Hakuna Mipaka Khaleesi. The lady which just came to say hello, that was Nyla. She's the biggest of the three females. And this one over there is Kiara. That's the sister of Khaleesi. And then right behind me, we got Leo and Snow, the two younger uh, males. Actually, Dexter is the oldest one and then Snow and then Leo. A complete pride once I united all of them with Dexter. Hello, my boy. Dexter is thinking about coming my way. Looks actually beautiful. Check this out. The king of the jungle. Here we go. Hello, boy. Yeah. These are your brothers, bro. Hello. Who is that? He's actually not giving a lot of reaction, which is not bad, but it's also not very interested. All right, this is Kiara. He's smelling Kiara. This is amazing, guys. I would have never expected it to go so well. I mean, that's the first time I, and also you guys, are seeing them interacting with one another. Check this out. Mm. Hello, Kiara and Khaleesi. Mm. He can be your girlfriend. She will be your girlfriend. Is that their paws are touching here these lines they come out of captivity they've never had parents they've never experienced how it is to live in a pride or to, to be like a lion and and now I can just see how they are socializing how they're bonding and this is just insane they'll be able to live a beautiful life a life which is meant for lions right boy this is what you guys deserve I'm almost falling in tears, man. This is so amazing. Fucking... I can't believe it. Hello, everybody. So we're getting ready here to go to the back of the farm with the monkeys and uh, chill with them in the nature. Are you might not stick your ass in my face, bro. Like a little family getaway. We are on our way to one of my favorite spots here in the oasis. The monkeys, they are doing amazing. They are running around all over the cliff and usually they're just hanging around the teddy or on my shoulders. But today, for some reason, they're really all over the place. And it's so amazing to see them just climbing around, running around and playing around here in the nature. African sunsets, there's nothing more beautiful than that. It's getting pretty dark there, and this is gonna be a little storm. And in Africa, this can happen within a few minutes. So we gotta rush back home to the main house, and once a big storm hits the farm, then it's not fun to be out. <laughs> Especially not for the little ones. So now we're gonna drive back down and see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you want to see what's next then make sure to subscribe my youtube channel right now and if you want to see more content you're so welcome to follow my other socials as well thank you so much for watching and see you guys later